and you have guys dead in reverse you have queen of cups in reverse you have king of cups in reverse you have tower in reverse <laughs> you have queen of pentacles in reverse and you have mm, so it was yeah and king of swords in reverse overall energy for you guys wow king of wands you upright feeling smug but what the heck is going on around you What the heck is going on around you, Sagittarius? You have four court cards here, five overall, and four in reverse. So either your situation involves family situation, or it involves company you work at but it involves not only you but involves in, in other people and i just said you know to scorpios how weird i think almost every single sign is just maybe one didn't but almost every single sign got from one on another deck queen of pentacles what is going on Everyone's and most of them <laughs> got it upright. But I think you, Sagittarius, may be struggling to put your shit together. Because I feel many of you are in huge denial. Just sitting there. Life's going on. And you're just sitting there and you know having this wand in your hand and just like who dares to come close to me who dares to say no to me who dares to you know move or whatever but the thing is you have two major arcanas and in, in reverse in reverse if it would be upright it would be ending situation changing everything from the ground you know i just massive changes in your life but this is not happening you don't see sun behind it you don't think that by ending something you will gain something you might think that it's like a battle, like with the, what expression, with the windmills. But for other group of you, I do feel, it's going to be a close call. Close call to lose something or someone. I really can't get it why you have so many people. So we have water couple. It's literally a couple. So there's couple involved. It could be you with someone. Or it could be your parents. It could be that you work for family business. Maybe if you work for a big comp company and you heard it's going to be many people fired and you just sit there just like, oh my God, oh my God, don't you dare to fire me. Just thinking to yourself, no, 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 no. It could be very close escaping you might stay. But not, I think it's just suggesting still looking for escape plan. Look for the escape plan plan because this place you are staying it's not good it's not gonna you know be forever 
or at least um, not going to bring you um, any rewards. How would you have so many? For others, I do feel you was about to get a divorce. Your partner may even uh, threaten you divorce or you've been threatening divorces. But your partner said, you know what? Put your shit together and I will stay. And you just... Oh, how dare you say that? How dare you say that? But in your head, not to that person. And just like, maybe she's right. Because... <laughs> Swords in reverse or vice versa situation uh, position. It's nothing good. It's just an asshole. Either you being an asshole to someone or someone is being asshole to you. And you're refusing to end this relationship. Or this kind of commitment. Interesting, Sagittarius. Interesting. I think you just, everyone just refusing to see situation for how there is. For some of you do think that you wanted to start something fresh, walk away from the, uh, your situation, maybe close the business because it's just said there's no prospects anymore. For some of you are leaving relationship behind, for some of you leaving work, family, business or something, and everyone just turning back on you. And she's just like, so what the hell are I supposed to do now? It's not going to work the way they're working. Why they don't see? And they may think that you're an asshole. They may even think that, you know, even though you are right. So let's get some clarifiers and see what's going on with those all those people around you. It's just ugh, five court cards. Seriously. If I'm gonna pull any more from this deck, I, I'm not. I don't know. For some of you, do feel um, messages coming through. You might be in some kind of religious um, thing, and you just can't escape. So, if you find yourself in this kind of position, or you in any group of people you think is not good, they're up to no good and something they have no value or something, and you f find it that you can't escape, ha ask your family to help. Ask your friends, family, uh, just get help. Okay, we have a sun, we have ten of pentacles, and we have a chariot, an overall energy page of wands. <laughs> Okay, so some kind of movement is going to happen. As I said, it could be for some of you either very close call to lose someone or something. Or for some of you, you want to end and finish something and you just can't, physically can't do yourself because you need people surrounded you. Um, supporting you, letting you where to live, financial support. It's just, even if in the past, you know, your parents didn't approve that step you've been taking and you can't escape, they're going to turn around. Don't worry. If you see them now back onto you, they will turn around. They will. Because we have a son. Because we have Ten of Pentacles. Because we have a chariot. Yay, two major arcanas for you, Sagittarius. After, I'm not, two another major arcanas for you. Um, but what, why I'm happy? Because those are great cards. It's moving forwards, brighter future, leaving what, look, she's leaving something dark behind her. She is moving on. So you will be able to move on. And look at this card. They have like chariot things, you know, like in some decks they have black and white, isn't it? So that's not moving on. That's not changing. 
the ways you've been doing things, the way something was done for ages or something. For some of you, do you feel if it's family business, maybe something was been doing for ages, you see it's not working and you have a great idea as how to move your business to the prosperous financial future with the Ten of Pentacles. Maybe you find it hard to convince them. So then prepare. Then prepare. Try to make, don't be sneaky, but take like, um, either make presentation for them, like with the bullet points. Fathers' this advice is like, try one client or something, uh, do different the way you think and show them that it worked. Because luck is on your side. Whatever shit was going on here, you're able to leave it behind and move forward. I'm sorry. My camera was just moving. So, oh, thanks God for those brilliant cards coming out to you guys. Be in your power, guys. For some of you, might be dealing with, for those who are interesting, you might be dealing with Cancer, you might be being li with Leo, Aries, uh, Scorpio people okay but you have strong your fiery energy in your reading in this side so you will be able to you know find a way if it's not happening right now it will happen soon okay one this one for you guys and the card says spiritual connection this relationship has a connection that goes behind this lifetime so I think this message is specifically for those <coughs> sorry, who think that the parents turn the back on them. They're not. Because you, they're not only your parents. They use spiritual connection. You, they, they're your parents. They won't leave you. Even, you know, if you, they say they will, if you're going to do this. For others, it's just for those who are going to be very close to losing the partner by divorce. You will be able to save it. For others, I need to mention, do feel if your partner is going to get into the accident, it's going to be fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's going to be fine. So, 27. Let's see what it says. And it says, everything happens for a reason. Know that some of the People that come into our life are just there just to help teach us a lesson and make a real impact on our life. But whether this is a love, soulmate relationship or relationship for growth, it is important to you in this lifetime. So this is, I, I feel this is a huge lesson for you guys. But what I like, whatever shit you in it, any shit situation, seriously, uh, please excuse my language. Um, but you will pull it through. You will pull it through, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. Wishing you all the best for upcoming week.